What's up, fellas? I kind of feel like I'm uploading too much here in 2019. Like, another episode of Spin to Win? Are you kidding me? We just had one yesterday. This is getting a little out of control. Someone Wait, shut your mouth. Shut, shut, your, shut your mouth. But regardless, I'm sure you are all happy, as am I, that we're putting out Spin to Win again. And I can't take a break, man, because we are close to finishing, but, like, we still could lose, which means I would need to upload a ton more. So let's go. Let's get it done with starting today. And we did leave off last episode at 8 and 0, which means if everything Thing goes perfectly play two games this video play two next video we could be done this series in two more episodes and honestly like i'm not guaranteeing that because if i have to sweat too much we're not playing two games but we're close at least and we're getting a big help today because last video i didn't play the greatest game like it was pretty ugly it was not my greatest performance but we won and we got one win reward and that reward was to acquire one diamond and as you guys know y'all had a ton of feedback now on the poll question i pretty much narrowed it down to a small forward and shooting guard that's what i want to add and i knew people were gonna vote this way clay thompson 57 percent of the votes like yeah yeah you just knew you knew but in the comment section there was an overwhelming movement it's like the guy has a cult following like this is his time to shine i know pg didn't get as many votes as clay but he is a glitch paul george get diamond paul george uh as your starting backup or small for that's another vote for paul the newer pg 13 is a beast he can play the two or the three yes get one of moments paul george cuts i literally that's four of the first five top comments on the video all for paul george so you know what we had to do oh quick shout out for my man carter there best series in 2k you know i gotta show some love shouting him out thank you very much we did go ahead and pick up diamond paul george in our lineup in our starting lineup he, he goes right there that was based off the comments man i could have taken clay but i don't know you guys had me convinced on this paul george card as well we'll go over to twitter because there's two almost identical cards of paul george they're both 95 overall so i asked is the newer one far better and i got a ton of response but pretty much people were saying that this one i picked up the new one is better at shooting and defense and the other one is better at rebounding and back to my line up we know i was looking for a small forward so definitely uh the newer one was the move to pick up for being a wing player he's got 99 layup with the shoe 89 shot three i hear he can shoot from really deep and his defensive attributes including like a 97 steal are awesome but that leaves us with one question off the bench because we got to keep clay in there he's been a stud this season amethyst j rich or amethyst vince carter as you can see i have j rich in there now but i also just put out a tweet asking for help in that one and the response is pretty much even this is kind of crazy j rich vc vince j rich j rich vince j rich j rich vince vince Vin like if i counted up those responses i think they're 50 50 split but in terms of overall stats on 2k empty central this j rich is slightly better honestly they're like the same card to me both of them are good i like both like there's no difference so i'm gonna start today jason kidd off the bench and i'm gonna say bye to vince carter but if in this first game we play j rich screws up or something vince is coming back in all right so we'll keep him in the holster but yeah i gotta go with jay rich and let's do it man eight and oh i'm so hyped we're gonna at least play one game obviously this video hopefully it's not too sweaty we'll be able to play a second but uh let's get to it let's get to some spin challenges and we failed both of these in the last episode of course so why wouldn't we uh the first one is oh uh, that one's not gonna happen one or fewer turnovers great i get more than one turnover in like two minutes of the first quarter every single game it's kind of crazy 10 dunks as a team jay rich let's see what you got okay that is an interesting opponent right there diamond richard lewis at point guard okay so yeah i mean he's got blake griffin looks like he's got no bench because he's a 69 overall all right we got this game six and a half hours later oh baby is this dude gonna run out of his pause timer before we even start the game you're ready through three you're through three pauses sir and i'm showing no mercy if you accidentally quit or run okay he's good L let me chill but here we go let's see i might not even have to do uh defensive settings here in this game if we start off the way i know we can let's go magic johnson yes oh richard where are you going that's a pull up oh that's a pull up mid-range good thing larry's there for a standing shot okay wow that's a great start to this game it's all good though both those shots weren't great oh paul george in transition starting you off with a mid-range on the team i like it i like his shot stroke a green release to start that is a good sign good contest by clay thompson yeah this man's gonna want to shoot a ton of threes you already know that let's go magic in transition step back go this way magic with the spin over to artist inside easy work artist gilmar all right he's jumpy on defense wants to shoot threes on offense i got him figured out already now with the addition of paul george i actually have clay thompson back at his true position of shooting guard let's see how he fares oh that was a bad release but he hit it okay so 
I think Clay Thompson's money, whatever position he's at. 9-7, this is a good start. I think, I think we're gonna, oh, I see this play from a mile away. Ah, they didn't let me through those screens so good enough though. Good enough, I see that play, yeah. I know what it is. Uh, Larry Johnson pull up. Oh, that wasn't a three. Dang it, Larry. Well, at least you hit it. That's, yeah, I can't complain about that. Oh, outside Paul George. Ah, Paul's shooting another mid-range. <laughs> okay, he's hitting it though in transition, which is uh, a nice little sign. So a six-point lead here. I've accidentally shot a couple more twos than threes on, on accident, but uh, I can't complain about being up by six. Good first quarter. And check it out. My man, Artis Gilmore, actually got takeover here. Oh, 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 he's not guarding. He's not guarding him anyways, but he does have takeover. So there, like I was saying last video, he's a stud. And whenever I get a card with takeover, over i always you know i can't sub him out to uh, to his start the second quarter we got to keep him in there even if it's for one or two possessions here and actually it went away by the time we got the offense that is just great but you know what we're still gonna go to him uh can we space the floor okay paul george get get out of here man artist inside pass fake finish he doesn't need takeover he's still scoring at will uh, we'll get the bench in here in a second but you know we're feeling good with the starters perfect <laughs> There's the Paul George three we've been waiting for. Artis Gilmore drive and kick. Man, that is not the strategy, but it works. Okay, we finally found time to get our bench in here. Start of the third quarter. Don't ask me how this is a one point game. This is exactly like yesterday's video. Like, I don't know how I'm not blowing this man out, but uh, <laughs> uh, 2K's holding his hand here today. No nothing new here. Give me that steal, thank you. This is the run we're about to go on. Giannis lobbing to Ben. And now we got a three point lead. Let's go bench. This actually isn't like my last game, because I. I think I'm playing great. Finally, thank you. Hey, buddy, you only got one pause left and I'm not giving you a second chance. But yeah, I actually think I'm playing really good. My strategies and everything are on point today. So finally, I'm starting to get rewarded. He has hit so many shots. Ugh. And there it goes, dude. No, I don't care. Do you guys think this is cheap of me because, um, like, it's a pretty good game? No, I'm gonna beat this dude anyways. You wanna keep pausing? Well, then this is your punishment. You gotta learn the rules. I'm quitting the game and receiving the win. I don't care. It is what it is. And there goes 9-0. I don't care if that seemed a little bit cheap, although I feel like I feel kind of dirty for doing that, but, uh, you know, it is what it is. Here's what I'll do. I won't count that as a rage quit, um, because it wasn't, right? Like, he just kept pausing even though he was in the game, so we'll just count one spin reward there for winning the game and i'm not gonna do it now i'm gonna wait till the end of the game because our lineup right now oh i love it so much let's get to 10 and 0 here boys no losing please jay that was me in the third person talking i'm sure it's what you were thinking as well though please don't lose good luck Oh, we get a matchup right away, and 2K is showing me so much love right now. That is a terrible lineup. We're going to be 10-0 here and you know, give or take five minutes. Now, I will say my opponent here, his lineup, oh, it just, oh, it just lagged ever so slightly on the tip. His lineup looks like a perfect budget squad. Like, it looks like some super cheap cards, but ones that, if you play this game a lot, could be really nice. So, we'll have to keep an eye out for him. I'm not saying he's trash, but I like the lineup we're facing. Good steal, Clay. Let's get our new boy, Paul George, involved early he's got heat check lebron on him and that was a terrible screen artist gilmore oh but that's a perfect mid-range that paul hits that's what i like to see man if you can succeed with that play you've got a spot on my team oh good steal did you see larry johnson pick that off oh i hit the wrong icon i wanted clay thompson oh he's still wide open <laughs> there we go i meant to hit him originally but of course clay switched icon so i gotta get used to that good assist i think paul george dropped that dime to him get back on defense yeah 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 we're there we're there this dude's low-key tearing me up though we do have 14 points we've started nicely offensively but please let me get some defense in here right, i'm going over the screen you stay with the roller there larry perfect perfect a little bit of lag uh didn't hurt us there he's got takeover with ad but it's not post scoring so we should be able to yeah stay right there perfect defense and 2k bails him out class let's try this again i like to mix this in because paul george he just seems like a power forward he's so tall and lanky that we get this mismatch oh yeah to the rim paul what was that animation <laughs> 2k sucked me into some weird animation there but hey he made it so i'm not complaining oh, and why did nobody remind me okay he's got ruby gilbert arenas in there why did nobody tell me to go to the post with magic i'm blaming you guys even though that makes literally zero sense i still am magic it's an easy bucket each time okay i'm so worried about playing defense because we're doing none of that here uh, i should be worried about scoring at will on this man uh that's a pretty good first quarter though i'll take it. and i've really started using my bench less this season of spin twin i don't know why like i think it's because i just have so many good players in the starting lineup i don't want to sub them out so we'll keep them in here even longer no no dude pass that ball to magic where i'm aiming there paul george good drop step inside 
What is that animation? <laughs> Did you see? He just, he went like from under here. In what NBA game have you ever seen that 2K? Magic would go up and finish strong with that. My word. Come on, Magic. Back to the post you go. We are not subbing in the bench until you dominate. Is that Russell or Damian Lillard? It's one of the number zeros. It's Dame. You're getting beasted in the post. Let's keep it going. Now let's play some freaking defense. I hear this Paul George clamps. There we go. And we get the steal. Larry Johnson, good boy. Uh, outside Clay. I'm not sure why you didn't go in to do a dunk, but I'll take the mid-range. It's all good, though. Three-pointers, yeah, we're getting a little bit tired, but here we go, bench. Uh, what are you doing, son? Inside, outside, Paul George, Larry Johnson, whoever you are, missing a shot. Gosh darn it, 2K. I'm not saying my plan of playing the starters the whole first half backfired, but, like, it, it could have gone better. Obviously, we're getting a little bit fatigued on some of these three-point attempts, but it is what it is. Magic inside. Yeah, buddy, he's not getting tired, and he's got takeover now. Let's go. Come on, Magic. Now you've got takeover, even though it's not, like, post-scoring or anything, but uh, we're gonna take advantage. Yeah, you want to double? Joel Embiid, uh, kick it out. Magic, yes. To the rim. Easy finish. Easy fit. What? <laughs> Shot clock violation. Man, I should be up by so much more than eight. Why do I suck so much recently? I, I just don't know. Oh, brother, this guy stinks! And now we are up by 18. Of course, when I turn off my face cam and commentary, uh, this ah! run would happen. <laughs> No way. No, he just left the match. Are you kidding me? I was just about to show you a montage of how I just blew this man out as soon as I stopped commentating. So yeah, I guess I'll show it to you here. It led to the rage quit. Shout out to Paul George, man. He got take over there. Uh, he heated up really, really quickly. And Magic Johnson, of course, with the mismatch. So 2K just spoon fed me two really bad opponents. And I doubt that happens next video, but we are 10 and oh, I actually had doubts this season that we were going to get here. I had to play way too many games. I lost way too many times and we're not done yet, but we're close boys. And shout out to this lineup, man. I don't know how we're going to get much better. Honestly, I have not been using my bench very much at all, but they are pristine. Dean, I guess Jay Richardson was the move because, you know, we won. So good. We won two games. We got one rage quit. I'm not counting the uh, pause timer of the other one. I don't think we got the spin challenges. I wasn't keeping track. So three spins is good enough for juicing up for our potential last episode. Let's see what the first one is. And we get ourselves a random age generator. Okay, there's no guarantee I'm gonna use these upgrades because it's gotta be better than what we have in our lineup. We'll do that after. Second spin is, oh my, it was literally right on the line between Amethyst and Sapphire. I know people want me to take this option off when we get deep in the season, but that's the risk. We don't know the reward is gonna be fire, at least for this season. And the third and final spin, take opponent's card. Oh, but my opponent just had pretty trash. Both guys had pretty trash lineups. I know one dude had Pink Diamond, Blake Griffin. When I go back to edit this video, I'll look at the two lineups we face and I will make a poll question right here. You guys vote. We'll see if we even want to add one of the cards because we played two pretty weak teams. So uh, yeah, stay tuned for that. As for the acquire one Sapphire card, that pretty much doesn't help us. So that's the second reward. The third random number or random age generator 38 we're not going to use because that's just what popped up first let's generate a number and it is 26 okay there's going to be some fire at age 26 and we're sorting all the current players which is how we do this by age in the nba and there's pretty much a ton of them looks like at the top of the list rudy gobert and kyrie irving actually the list isn't that crazy i'm sorting by win shares uh, unless i'm missing people it's I, like kyrie's cool rudy gobert's cool we might have got ourselves the most trash age out here tobias harris actually i think he's got a nice little card kyrie irving actually has like a million diamond cards so obviously this would be 
be the 26 year old we'd want to go with but I don't know man I'm loving what I have with my team now especially because I have so much size running Giannis at the point off the bench I mean you guys let me know if you want to see Kyrie Irving diamond uh we'll have to take him and actually I've heard good things about this uh, Amethyst Tobias Harris card he's also 26 years old probably a nice little demi guy he would probably fit nicer alongside my team but I wouldn't want to replace Ben Simmons with him so hey you guys let me know about the random age generator also when I get some of the players that were on my opponent's teams you can let me know there but hey I don't need to upgrade this lineup necessarily I'm confident we can go 2-0 and next video as well and get the pink diamond Hakeem Olajuwon man that would be amazing and as always let me know all the feedback on all those things we talked about down below uh we are almost at the end of this season unless I lose but that's not gonna happen right make sure you slap a big old thumbs up on this video for you boy I know you've all been showing mad love recently so let's keep it rolling with another episode of spin to win and that is all I got for this one guys I'm Jake Hanna you all stay golden